Hey guys, it's Dr. Robotnik64. This is part 18 of my playthrough of Pokemon Leaf Green. So in the last part, well, we defeated everybody at, uh... Wait, what was it again? Yeah, the Fighting Dojo, we defeated everybody there. We also got Hitmonlee, uh, from this guy right there, so yeah. Another Pokemon added to the Pokedex. And we also went to Silk Co. and got rid of Team Rocket, so yeah. And while we were doing that, we also got a Lapras as well, so... Total Pokedex now is at 25. I'm not really going for a 100% play like complete playthrough on this, because I don't plan on catching all the Pokemon in this game, so... But yeah, now we can go to the gym here. Let's do it then. So yeah, in this part, we are going to fight the gym leader of Saffron City, which is Sabrina. Yo, champ in the making, Sabrina's Pokemon use psychic power instead of force. Fighting Pokemon are especially weak against Psychic Pokemon, which is why I actually put Primeape in the Pokemon Sword system for now. They'll get destroyed before they can even aim a punch. And this looks like... Okay, probably Sonic's been here. Oh my. He's everywhere, for goodness sakes. So, yeah. So as you can see, I still have my overpowered level 50 Charizard. Um... Yeah, so I have Nido King and Nido Queen out here. I don't know, maybe go ahead and be cheap and just use Charizard for everything? I don't know. Let's just do this. Um... Hmm. Yeah, this appears to be a maze. Oh, wait a second. Leo didn't even seem to change. Hmm. Well, not that I'm not going to fight the trainers here, but... Oh, she's right over there. Yeah, probably just keeps going all around. Let's go, then. Does our unseen power scare you? Not really. Who we got? We got Psychic Johan. Or Johan. Another Kadabra. Only level 31. Alright. Got Max Ethers anyway, destroy him with Flamethrower. I'm not... And of course, that's a critical hit. I'm not exactly sure uh, what kind of type psychics, psychic types are weak against, so that's why I'm just using Charizard here. S slow poke... Oh darn, I should've... Um... I actually should've... Switched out. Wow, he actually missed, okay. Never mind, didn't have to switch out and didn't have to switch out because Slowpoke could use water gun, that's why. Mr. Mayim I'm not gonna switch. Okay. And another Kadabra. Alright. Well, that's it for that. Yeah, maybe my Charizard is overpowered, but... I never foresaw this. Psychic Pokemon fear only ghosts and bugs. Oh. Okay, ghost-type Pokemon, bug-type Pokemon. Okay. Uh, how about I... How about I try both panels? Okay. This leads me to that guy again. Oh. Well, geez, just like that I figured it out, for goodness sakes. Are you Sabrina? I had a vision of your arrival. I've had psychic powers since I was a child. Oh. You're just like Paula on Earthbound. It started with a, when a spoon I carelessly tossed bent. I dislike battling, but if you wish, I'll show you my powers. Yeah, this is Sabrina. Well, okay. That was easier than I expected it to be. I'd like, getting to her, I mean. You're done. 50, level 51, great. 
Mr. Mime, I shall not switch out. Okay. Wait a second, there's actually female Mr. Mime, so wouldn't that be Mrs. Mime, for goodness sakes? I don't know. Okay. Um, is this... Oh, this is actually super effective. Very good. And an Alakazam. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Level 43. Probably not gonna take him out in one hit. Okay, never mind. And just like that, Sabrina's been defeated. So, you know what? I think I am being cheap. So, this loss shocks me, but a loss is a loss. I admit, I didn't work hard enough to win. Your victory has earned you the Marsh Badge. Yeah. The Marsh Badge makes Pokemon up to level 70 obey you. Stronger Pokemon will become wild, ignoring your orders in battle. Don't raise your Pokemon too much to avoid that problem. Please take this TM with you. What is this? Probably... Or wait, what? what is it? Psychic power is something that only a few people have. Everyone has psychic power. People just don't realize it. Okay, but... What exactly is that? It's... Okay, I think it's Calm Mind. Yeah, Calm Mind. User focus, foc focuses... What? Focuses its mind to raise special attack, special defense stats. Okay, well, I think the next place I'm going to be going to is Cinnabar Island, and I have to have a Pokemon that knows Surf, and there's Water-type Pokemon, so... Yeah... And I'm pro probably not going to use Charizard very much anyway, so... I think I'm going to take a break from using Charizard for a little while, because look at this, six badges already. I'm just having Charizard annihilate everybody. Need to start using my other Pokemon, for goodness sakes. I think this is the way I took, the route I took, to get out. Or no, or no it wasn't. Or was it? I don't know, but I skipped most of these trainers, though, so... Okay, hold on. Okay, that is interesting. Apparently, this is the only gym, or at least the only gym I know of in the game, where you can actually use an escape rope to escape. Interesting. Okay, well, it's because I didn't want to go through all the trouble of trying to get back, but we're back anyway, so, um, might as well heal up very quickly. Okay, I actually just went back to Fuchsia City and went to the Safari Zone. I found gold teeth, and apparently the warden popped in his teeth. Thanks, son, you're a real lifesaver. No one could understand a word I said, not a one. I was too ashamed to show my face around the office, even. Let me give you something for your trouble. HM4, which I believe is strength. Yep, it's strength. Pokemon move boulders outside battle. And actually, I did find a secret house, and there I actually learned Surf. Yes, because apparently Lapras didn't already have it. I also used uh, the two rare candies on Lapras. I actually found another uh, rare candy in Cerulean City, so yeah. Uh, let's try it out here. Wait a second, Nidoking can also learn Surf as well? What the heck? I didn't know he could even learn that move. Okay, I'm giving the Surf to Lapras, though, not Nidoking. Forget Parish Song. I don't think that's a very good move, anyway. Lapras learns Surf. Alright, finally we can go to Cinnabar Island. But first of all, I need one that, you, that knows how to use Strength. I think I'll actually give that to Nidoking, probably. Yeah, just forget Helping Hand. We, I think we do have some double battles coming up, though, but I'm gonna have him learn this anyway. I don't really care. Well, I could have also gave it to Rhyhorn or Sandslash, but no. By the way, while I was in, uh... While I was in the, um... Safari Zone, I also caught a uh, Nidoran female. I was actually not trying to, but I accidentally threw a Safari Ball and it caught. I also caught Paris as well, so yeah. Anyway, let's try this out then. Using strings. What is... Yep, maybe possible move boulders around. What's in here? Another rare candy. Alright, well. Alright. 
And uh, actually, I also want to mention this. Um, yeah, I have lappers in my party, obviously, so... But summary here. I actually kept lappers at uh, the daycare service a bit. Yeah, that didn't do much. I'm not going to use the rare candy on it just yet, because it's pretty close to leveling up anyway. So, yeah. I already took out these trainers in the meantime, so... Um... Let's do this then. Actually, no, hold on. I just want to save one more time. I don't know, because I'm always worried about everything. Which I pretty much am. I am pretty much like that in real life as well. I worry about everything. I worry too much. Anyway. Alright. And actually, there's also wild Pokemon here. Um, I still have a lot of money, actually. Yeah, I still have a ton. Um, I also found protein. I'm not going to use the rare candy just yet. Protein's base attack. Um, what was I trying to find again? Oh yeah, my max repels. I also bought a f about 10 more as well, so they're at 20 now. I'm pretty sure they... We do have random encounters here, so... Let's go! Wow, that guy turned away at the last second. That was kind of lucky, I guess. Okay, forget it. And that guy was trying to swim around me. We certainly have a lot of trainers here. This is water, so I'm not probably not going to use uh, Charizard for this a whole lot. Oh, actually. Oh yeah, my town map's already registered. How about I look at the town map, see if I'm going the correct way. Yeah, I'm Route 19, the Seafoam Islands. Yeah, I think that's where I'm trying to go. Yeah. Oh, hi. The water is shallow here, there are many people swimming. That's shallow water? Okay. Alright, got our first battle on water here. We got shelter. I know Pidgeot's not super... It's. I know water's not super effective against uh, Pidgeot right here. Oh wait, I forgot to... I forgot to heal them. Well, if I remember correctly, I think there is actually a gym in Cinnabar Island, so... If that's the case, then there's probably also a Pokemon Center somewhere around there, so... I'm not really worried. Oyster? Uh, aerial, aerial Ace didn't do much. Oh, and he can also use Protect as well, which is great. You can see he basically protects himself against attacks. He's gonna use it the entire time. No, no, it's not. Okay, he's almost Aurora Beam. What the heck is that? And of course, that's super effective. And of course, it doesn't do a whole lot to me, even though it is super effective against me, apparently. Makes perfect sense right there. Okay, done. Alright, de defeated Barry here. Splash! Okay, anyway. That was our first uh, trainer battle on water. Did I go around her? Yeah. Darn, we're already here, for goodness sakes. Uh, where are we? Yeah, this is the Seafoam Islands. Uh, what is actually in here? Oh, okay, um, once again, not exactly sure how long I've been recording for, but, oh wait, is this place blocked off? Yeah, it does appear, it does appear to be, you just swim around it, but, actually, we're on the Seafoam Islands, um, if I do remember correctly, there is actually a Pokemon we can catch in there, it's actually a legendary Pokemon in, uh, the Seafoam Islands, not gonna say what it is, it's not the one that I want to catch in the Master Ball, though. In fact, I actually do not recommend you use your Master Ball to catch it. So, actually, I think I, yeah, I think I am going to end the video off here, so yeah. So we made it to the Seafoam Islands, defeat another trainer, I think I'm done for now. That's the end of this video. So this is Dr. Robotnik64, thank you for watching. If you want, feel free to like or favorite this video, or maybe subscribe. 
And also feel free to follow me on Twitter as I post alerts about videos I recently upload to there. The link to my Twitter account is in the description of all my videos, including this one, so yeah. But that's it for now, so we'll see you guys in the next uh, part of this playthrough then. Um, I don't know, I don't really plan on catching all the Pokemon here, but I don't really plan on catching the legendary Pokemon in, in this cave right here, so not really anyway. Maybe in the next part I'll just continue on to Cinnabar Island, but yeah, that's it for now. Later.